Hey, it's time for us to give you entertainment gist. And today we're going to be doing a bit because today is flashback. We're flashing back to how Whiskey and Banky W met. Yes. There's a video clip we're going to play for you. So check it out. And when we come back, Edewa and I will be talking some more about this. He had been signed, you know, we've been making music and releasing music. And we were just being cheeky and we were just being playful at the time when those tweets were sent. I didn't find ways from him tweeting at me. You know, yes, use Twitter, you know, do what you feel like you need to do, but I didn't find ways um, from him tweeting at me. I found him working. I had heard of his music when I was just listening to a bunch of unsigned artists. In fact, before he even started working with me, he had already recorded a first uh, a chorus for MI. In fact, the very first day that I saw Wiz in person, he was Kel's hype man. We were all at a show, myself, MI, LD, Kel, and Wiz was uh, faithfully serving as Kel's hype man. You know the hype man, when the artist is performing, the person that is shouting, yeah, yeah, uh-huh, what's up, you know, singing the chorus and just backing the person up. Wiz was essentially Kel's backup singer. And when, even when Wiz started working with me, he was my hype man, my backup singer, maybe for a year and a half. Now look at it today. Wiz has probably done more, well, not probably, Wiz has done more in the music business than any one of us, than me, than M.I., than Kel, than L.D., all of us who were at that show when I first saw him in person for the first time. But how did he get there? He started by serving. The starting point on the road to success begins with service. It begins with stewardship. It begins with being faithful with what does not even belong to you. It begins with being faithful to another person's dream or another person's property or another person's company. That's where it begins. So when God or the helpers that he will use to change your life come to find you? Will they find you serving? Will they find you working? Or will they find you tweeting? Will they find you complaining? Will they find you pointing fingers or wallowing in self-pity or sitting in your house and hoping that God is going to come into your room and make your dream come true from there? Or will they find you out on the streets working and serving? Be faithful with what you have to get what you want. Be faithful with where you are. Be trustworthy. Be committed. Be dedicated. Be a good steward. Serve faithfully. And if you do that, if God finds you serving, if God finds you as a good steward, then God will promote you into your destiny. But you must pass the stewardship test first. And that is a beautiful video by Banky W. And there's one message. If there's nothing that you take away from all that he said, what will you be doing? What are you doing in this season? Serve the season you're in. You're probably doing a job you don't like. Do it with your heart. Do it extra. Give extra such, such that when the opportunity comes for you to do the job that you actually like, you've been prepared. You've sown seeds that you will reap in due time. To enjoy more of this, our will get videos when you just watch. Press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.